Welcome back to the Lights Out Podcast, bedtime stories for boys and girls around the world. Good evening, boys and girls. Are you ready for bed? Are you all snuggled up and ready for another Lights Out bedtime story? Well, you're in for a treat tonight, because tonight's story is called Father by Graham Baker Smith. And a big shout out goes to all the awesome authors and amazing listeners who are helping this show reach its mission of a thousand ad-free stories forever for boys and girls and crayons around the world. So let's get back to the story, because it's all about the story, Father. Poppies lined the path to my father's house. It was made of stone and slate and fastened deep into the cliff. It was safe and rooted in the rock. But inside, my father dreamed of air and flight. Day and night, he sewed and stitched, and sawed and hammered, and trimmed the feathers of a thousand hopeful wings. But sometimes there was silence. My father would appear and stare at the ocean with tired, distant eyes. I would sit on his lap until he remembered me. Then, like a great wind, he would scoop me up and run outside, along the old cliff paths, over the rocks, onto the beach. He would fish and swim and play cricket. He would teach me the names of all the birds. We would be together until the dream of flying returned. Such a busy, bossy dream that would not leave him alone or give him the time to play or sleep or think of other things or even have the grace to come true for my father, after all, never flew though he made so many beautiful things and so many lovely wings. Nothing he did could claim the sky But then another call claimed him. I will always remember the day he left. The clothes they gave him, khaki against the scarlet poppies. Many years passed, and my father's dream waited until I was almost grown. And then one day it spoke to me. I took up the old wings made a few simple adjustments and flew. In the vast blue sky, I felt my father with me. I soon became a common and everyday sight around these parts, making myself useful and helping wherever I could. And now I have my own son. What will he do, I wonder? if my father's dream should visit him. The End of Father by Graham Baker Smith A beautiful book that you just have to read. And that's the winner of the Kate Greenaway Medal. A multi-layered magical picture book that will be read and looked over again and again. Here on the Lights Out Podcast Bedtime stories for boys and girls around the world. Good night.